An airfoil marks the beginning of our journey through the universe of NTOP5. We start with a scene that is one meter wide, the airfoil shape driven by parametric thickness and camber fields as defined by the National Advisory Committee for Aeronautics, or NACA. We extrude out to 10 meters and see that design parameters varying spatially can also be used to control the shape of the wing, like the trailing edge sweep angle. An entire plane comes into view. We now have multiple field-driven design parameters driving the location and shape of the wing and the internal structure. We interact with these parameters to get a feel for the overall design space of this computational model. To understand the fitness of the design, simulation is used in the loop of this computational design process. We automatically wrap the implicit in a mesh surface ready to export for analysis as parasolid or step. Here, an external flow analysis is run in sim scale in order to calculate the loads on the entire structure. The resulting pressure data is imported back into NTOP, wired up to run a stress simulation on the airframe in order to better understand the fitness of this design point. We now zoom out past 100 meters, the distance a man can run in 10 seconds. We explore 125 variations of this concept design. 1 kilometer, 1,000 meters, the distance a race car can drive in 10 seconds. 10 kilometers, the distance a supersonic aircraft can travel in 10 seconds. The NTOP computational design summit comes into view. 10 to the 5th meters, the distance an orbiting satellite covers in 10 seconds. 10 to the 6th, a 1 with 6 zeros, 1 million meters. We apply a spherical mapping of the Earth topographies using a high-resolution image imported from the NASA Visible Earth Catalog. Sphere cubes surround us, millions of uniquely sized implicit spheres and cubes union together to fill an ellipsoid. We pause to start back home. Ten meters, entering the inlet duct of the aircraft to reach the engine, slowing up at one meter. Just like the overall airplane, this engine demonstrator is also a computational model parameterized to important design features. We rotate around and the outer casing comes into view. The stiffening ribs are parameterized against fields that vary spatially throughout this model, enabling precise control over sizing and spacing. At 10 centimeters, we control the size of the rounds where these stiffening ribs meet each other and meet the case. Cutting away the upper half of the engine, the stages of the compressor and turbine are also driven by spatially varying fields. The location and sizing of the combustor section are parameterized from a curve. One centimeter, or 10 to the negative second meters, the film cooling system is parameterized to fields driving the sizing and spacing, or angle. One millimeter, the inside of a cooling channel. At this scale, texturing is applied for more effective heat transfer. Zooming in further, 10 to the negative fourth meters, or 100 microns, we model the crystal structure of 3D printed Inconel using a 3D cell packing, or Voronoi, algorithm. to the negative 6 meters, or 1 micron, we reach the definition of one unit cell. We run a homogenization study to calculate the anisotropic material properties as measured at this length scale. Our journey has taken us across 16 powers of 10 in order to better understand the precision and speed of the new NTOP5 core modeling technology. If now the field is one unit, when we were traveling through the sphere cubes it was 10 to the 16th power or a one with 16 zeros.